James, it doesn't seem like five minutes since we're celebrating promotion against Scunthorpe, but the new season is upon us already. Yeah, I know. It comes around quick, like they all say, but um, let's hope that we can take that momentum that we built up towards the end of last season. I think we put together a good run and obviously achieved something incredibly special that will live long in the memory. But for us now, it's that next chapter. It's about moving on from it, not forgetting it, but drawing on the positives from it because we've kept a lot of the squad that, that did the impossible last year and we've kept sort of the nucleus of the side together and, and we've added quality to that so for us yeah it's looking forward looking forward to the challenge of league one football um, and yeah very sort of happy um, of where we sit going into the season. You personally you weren't here obviously during the relegation time but now as some players are and they were do you think some have got a few points to prove about being back in league one? I think I think every season you've got a point to prove that Myself, I've not played at League One, so looking forward to testing myself at that level. But I think we, the players that came in last year, like myself, we sort of could see the, the relegation hangover, so to speak. And it took a while to kind of, the gaffer to implement his ideas. And whereas now we're kind of a more settled side. But yeah, there's, there's always players with points to prove. There's, there's players fighting for shirts and the 11 that's selected on Saturday will, will hopefully go out there and, and do a job. and put some sort of difficult decisions into the manager's head because I think he's made no secret that he does want to bring a few more bodies in um, to, to strengthen the squad. So it's a chance for lads to, to stake the claim for the shirt. I think once you're in the shirt, you've got to make it hard to, to well, for someone to take it off you. So yeah, it's all to play for. And the icing on the cake last season for you has obviously been named player of the year. It's always a strange one though, isn't it? A team gets promoted and the goalkeeper's player of the year. It's kind of hard for people to get their heads around, but um, Talk us through, you know, your, the, the first part of the season last year. Yeah, I think you can sort of look at last season in two halves, the way we were at the start of last season and the, the difficult spot we were in. And myself, I was probably relied on uh, at times a bit more than a bit more than I'd have liked, probably a little bit busier. But for me to, to play my part in, in that season and yeah, it was a huge honour to be to be voted player of the year by the by the lads and, and receive the accolades. It's yeah, very humbling and but yeah, for me now and for everyone, the gaffer said it's a clean slate. So what you've done last year is sort of consigned to history and it's about what you do going forward. So people have short memories in football. If you don't start the season well, then last season will be, be forgotten pretty quickly. So for me, it's about keep pushing my standards, keep maintaining high standards and, and continuing to perform at a high level. And if I'm contributing to a successful team, then I'm happy. Going up last year with us, obviously, Forest Green, and that's our opponent first game of the season. What are we looking to expect from them? Yeah, it'd be a tough test. It's For them, it's their first sort of sniff at League One football and got a new manager in who I more know from managing Notts County. Um, so they'll be organised, they'll be a well-drilled side um, and they'll be coming in full of confidence. Let's not forget they won the league at our place last year and for us, a lot of Rovers players, that, that hurt sort of seeing the, the scenes of them celebrating on, on our pitch. So... But yeah, it's the first game of the season, everyone has the kind of, it's all drummed up as the, the big start, but it, it's only one game out of 46, so we, like we, we saw last season, it only matters where you are after game 46, not after game one, but, but yeah, it's a, it's a tough test, it's, they, they've lost a few players, but they've added some quality to it, same as us, we've lost a few players, but we've added quality, so yeah, it'd be a real sort of entertaining game, I think the, the mem sold out. I think the first few games are sold out from what I've seen, so the atmosphere is going to be electric in there. And, and for us, it makes all the difference having thousands of gas heads behind us and, and driving us on. So, yeah, I'm sure they can drive us to another successful season.